your free time before busy time will come to you. The Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam is telling you now you are free. You don't have anything to do. Make the best use of it. Use that of your free time to learn about Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala. Use that of your free time to seek the provision of Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala. Save some money. Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam is telling you make the best use of your I mean make the best use of your free time before busy time will come to you. Because today subhanallah I think one of the examples I will give is my own father. Whenever we are sitting, if I'm reciting the Quran, he will tell me that Allah be great. I wish there can be someone here who can be fully responsible so that I can just go out and memorize the book of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. But now I can't do it. As a father, I must sit at home, look after my kids, take responsibility as we all know. But this is his dream by day and night. Even though he got a child who memorized the Quran, alhamdulillah, but still he is regretting why he didn't memorize the Quran. And we ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to make him among the people who will get the high level of the Hufad even without memorizing the Quran. Because I keep saying this, there is one Imam Hudayfi from Mecca. He says this, Al-Hafidh, man ya'mal bil Quran wa illam yahfadhu. The true Hafidh is someone who implements the Quran, follows the teachings of the Quran even if the person doesn't memorize it. وَلَيْسَ الْحَافِظُ مَنْ لَا يَعْمَلْ بِالْقُرْآنِ وَإِنْ كَانَ حَفِظَهُ But the Hafiz is not someone who does him implement the teachings of the Qur'an even if the person memorizes it. So don't see someone who memorizes the Qur'an, listening to music, doing haram things, and still you, you know, seeing the person as a Hafiz. No, the real Hafiz is someone who is following the Qur'an who is following the teachings of Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. And we ask Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala to make us among these who